Hello everyone, in this video I will explain to you a really simple way to set up a dual PC uh, station for streaming uh, using the video capture, capture card Avermedia uh, Live Portable 2 Plus. If you like this video or you find it useful, please subscribe to my channel. Let's go with the explanation. To set up my streaming station, my personal choice were for two Intel NACs. NAC 11 Phantom Canyon for gaming and NAC 8 uh, Canyon for streaming. Gaming PC is more powerful for gaming, but also the streaming PC is powerful enough so that I can stream in high resolution on 60 FPS. As card pure card, my personal choice is the Avermedia Live Portable 2 Plus card, but the setting I'm telling you will probably work also on other similar capture cards. On the gaming PC there will be just one monitor connected that I will use to play, so it will keep all its gaming specs like refresh, frequency, HDR and so on. I will connect to the capture card HDMI in my HDMI out from my PC as, it, as if I was connecting a second monitor to my gaming PC. The capture card must be connected to the streaming PC to any of the USB port through the power supply port in the back of the capture card. Be sure that it's installed and configured to work with the software. In your gaming PC, go to settings and then screen. You will see uh, two monitors, also if uh, only one is connected, if both PC are on. Here you can choose the setting for your monitor the resolution and you have to use the, the extend these monitors then you go to uh, advanced processes and you can choose your frequency or uh, uh, whatever you want for the uh, monitor you use for gaming and for the virtual monitor you will see that you will have 60 hertz that is uh, the frequency the video card allows you to pass through the software is a personal choice, but I used OBS Studio on the gaming PC that won't stream anything but is much lighter than other softwares and I will use for streaming on the streaming PC uh, Streamless OBS because it's a personal preference. On your gaming PC you start OBS and create a very simple scene with just a game capture in it. Then to add audio you go to uh, settings for audio and you get properties. In properties you select your audio card out. Can be different than mine but you choose your audio card output. Then to have the audio on the HDM cab HDMI cable without any other cable you select in advanced properties monitor and send audio to the port. After this you go to the scene press with right click and you get projector and you project the virtual monitor, the one connected to the streaming PC, um, here, clicking OK. Now on the gaming PC, I open my Streamlabs and you create a sheen, I already did it for cause, and with the plus, you added a video and the audio in. So, a video and the audio in source. So for the video, you will set uh, Live Game Portable 2 Plus, then you change all the settings you want. And for the audio, you will set Microphone Live Game Portable 2 Plus, so that you will have the video and the audio, you can start streaming with audio and video. Thank you guys for watching my video, I hope you enjoyed it and you find it useful. Uh, if you enjoyed it or find it useful, please, uh, to support me, subscribe my channel down here. Thank you very much and see you to the next video. Bye bye!